now we're learning how to work with the other classes and how to work on the, on the stage that we're performing. We're in the United Pettus Church on West 175th Street. They said the stage is going to be small, but it's actually good. It's a good size stage. As you see, all of this, it's like heaven. It's like the big, like what they say about heaven. All gold and beautiful. Wow. When they told us you're going to be in the theater, I didn't know it was going to be huge. And when I first saw it inside here, I was like, wow, this is like, this is cool. Guys, I'm going to ask you again to please check yourselves for earrings, watches, hair jewelry, as I call it. We took our hair out for, for the people who think that we're really hunters and our hair is wild, like we're crazy. <laughs> hey, look, I just wanted to come and say hello. I'm Simon. I'm conducting. Yeah. I just wanted to tell you, I'm gonna, I'll get to see a little bit of what you're doing, but when, we, when we're working on Saturday, how you dance really affects how we play. It's not, we're not like a soundtrack. I mean, we'll, we try to play what's there, but what you do really affects what we do. And so we'll all be watching and trying to get, trying to get this in together. He's the conductor for the Berliner, Berliner Philharmoniker, which is gonna be over there playing. He's cool, he's cool. His curly white hair, that's, that's cool. If you're orange, you're not standing next to orange. If you're blue, you're not next to blue. If you're green, you're not next to green. We met up with the schools, and then we were kind of confused because I didn't know all these people. I didn't know where they had to go. So if I didn't know where they had to go, how would I know where I was supposed to go? Have you ever done this Friday Spring Dance? You should try because it's hard work. I don't work on the twitching. I'm not doing so good in the twitching. I don't know where, where, which, which side should, should I be in, that side or that side. Some of my partners that were with me in the Twitchy part at, at Choir Academy, they're on that side, some of them are that side. So it's messing my head up. If you're in the wrong place, the audience must never know you've made a mistake. And for the wild section and for reaching for the moon, it's always the same identical position where you do the wild section and the thing with lifting your arm. They have been putting in on like big signs all over the place telling us which part goes next. And that's what really tells us where we, where we actually need to go. Hold it. Don't move. Hey there, don't move. Don't move. Don't move. Then it's completely dark. Okay, sit up. I'd like you to think about the last six or seven weeks. I'd like you to remember how we said to you at the beginning, Trust us, trust us, we will take you there. I'd like to think how many of you did not trust us. Look back and say to yourself, I hope, I wish I hadn't been like that. I didn't need to be like that. I can do this. That's what I want you to learn more than anything. When you are faced with a challenge, go with it. Go with it from the beginning. Put yourself in. It's such an interesting contrast. There's a battle going on between the part of you that says, I am amazing, and the part that says, I am not. You've got to let the second part in. Bye. Bye. I feel like I may make a mistake on the day of the show. So I'm just praying that everything will be good.